Right, how are we all doing guys? I hope we are all good. Um, pretty shame. <laughs> doing work on that boat, that takes it out of you, I'll tell you. Uh, we've made a good start on that. We've done a couple of days now, and we have made a good start. Um, right, only problem being is, um, obviously I created a YouTube channel for people to follow to see what we're doing with the boat, boat side of things. Um, and I'll tell you what, I've had about 30 subscribers. There's at least 30 of you that watch my fishing channel that have jumped over to that to follow it, which is absolutely awesome. Uh, the only bad thing is, I tried to upload a video to the channel earlier. It was having none of it. Like, absolutely, it was asking me to verify this, verify, verify your Google account. This is a new channel, you said. Verify your, very, verify your Google account. It was sending a code to my phone. I was putting the code in, didn't want to know. I was putting passwords in, didn't want to, oh, I don't know. It just did not want to know. Um, I created the channel using my phone. So whether that made a difference, because now, like the other channels I've created, I've always used the laptop to create them, but I've created it using my phone. So uh, it's computers. I'm absolutely useless with, I'm about as good as with computers as I am catching bass. <laughs> On alert. So that just goes to show you, doesn't it? Um, right, I've created a new channel for the boat. I've done it on the laptop, channel was all working. I've uploaded a video to the channel. There was a video on there, so it's all absolutely, it's working, it's all great. Um, so I'm really, 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 really sorry, guys, for all of those that took the time to either hit the link and follow the channel or type the channel in and follow the channel, subscribe to it. You, you've all, people have done it and the channel's not even working. I'm really sorry, guys. That channel's now gone, that's been deleted. There's a new channel on there, a similar name. The channel name is Birchwood 22 Boat Restoration with Dave. I'm gonna put the link in the description of this video as well. So you can either go on YouTube and type in Birchwood 22 Boat Restoration with Dave, or you can just hit the link in the description and that takes you straight to the channel. Um, I feel a bit bad, like I say, because a lot of you have done it already, 30, 30 or people have, and those 30 have done it, have only come from this channel, it hasn't been anywhere else, I haven't put it anywhere else, it's only been from here. So I'm really sorry guys, I'm really sorry. Uh, but if you do carry on, if you still want to follow the process and see what we're doing and how the boat's working out, then yeah, jump over to that one and there'll be no more glitches, I guarantee you. Like I say, I've got a video on it now, it's all on there, uploaded, ready for you guys to watch. Um, Computers, I'll say they're just doing my head in. I'm not good with them. I'm not good with them. Uh, fishing wise, do you know what I was saying on the last video? The last week and a half or so, been very quiet. A lot of people been blanking all around it. Uh, K Star, Yarmouth, Galston, Colton. There's been one or two coming out, but nothing like no one's been going down there and putting fish out all day. Anyway, I was reading a few reports this morning from a few various Facebook pages, and sort of yesterday, today, people have been doing all right. The fish are starting to show again. Been smooth hounds coming out, there's been bass coming out, dogfish coming out. So, for whatever reason, it could be wind direction, anything can upset it, but people are catching now, fish are coming in. Also, reading reports that mackerel are being caught off Great Yarmouth Beach. Now, that's a first for me. I know if you've got a uh, kayak or a small boat, or people go out like a few hundred yards. You can catch them a few, like a few hundred yards out. But I've never known to be able to catch mackerel off Great Yarmouth Beach. You've always had to go North Norfolk off the beaches, but they're being caught. And I'm guessing, I'm, I'm guessing people just using feathers as, as normal. So that is awesome that the mackerel will show on the Great Yarmouth Beach, awesome. Um, also, I've got a mate, he was out with his missus the other day, walking the dog early in the morning, and he sent me a video. And he goes, look at these, mate. And he was showing these fish swimming around. And he goes, what are they? And I looked at the video, and I was like, they're mullet. I was like, where are you? Because I'm, I'm, he's local to me, he's local. I was like, where are you? And he goes, just up past the Swan. He goes, just on that tar, tar lane, I think it's called, uh, just off Lawn Avenue. He goes, we're just up there walking the dog. Now, I have never, ever, ever known mullet to swim up there. Never. Um, I know they get him in Lowestoft, in Lowestoft Harbour. They come into the harbour there. But I have, uh, people might comment and go, oh yeah, they come in every year. But I've never, I've never seen mullet up there by that swan pub towards that tar lane. I've never seen it. Uh, and the guy where we went, moored the boat, the guy we moored the boat off, was talking to him the other day about fishing, and even he said the last few mornings, he's been out early in the morning and he's seen mullet swimming around up by the swan pub, which is absolutely awesome, isn't it? So that gives us a bit more 
variety on fishing. Like I say, you can go North Beach with your feathers and get a few mackerel out. Or what me and Jordan are planning on doing. Like I say, the boat's taking up a lot of time at the moment. It's taking up a lot of time. We do want to get it done. But we were saying, we are going to have a morning fishing. Our plan is to get up near the Swan Pub, up towards that tar lane, early morning. Literally, fishing line, hook, crust of the bread, just throw that crust in and just let it float on the surface. That's how I used to catch the mullet. Just used to let it float on the surface, mullet come up, just grab it. Uh, I normally take a landing net with me as well when I do the mullet fishing, because they've got really soft lips, and I've had a few. When we used to go and Dorset and catch them, as you're reading them in, you're getting them up very easily tear through the lip. Their lips are very soft. So we started using the long landing nets. As soon as they were close in, get the net under them and bring them in, and then there's no way they can come off the hook. So yeah, so me and Jordan are planning. I, I assume G's gonna come along as well. Uh, G probably be up for it, but me and Jordan were talking about earlier. We're definitely planning to go and get a few, uh, few money out. And then maybe one night, evening, just like a sundown sort of thing. Seven, eight in the evening, maybe hit North Beach with a few feathers, see if we can get a few mackerel out. So that is the plan. Uh, but yeah, boat, 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 that is number one priority. We want to get this boat how we want it. We just want it how we want it. And I keep lying as well. I keep saying on this channel, uh, no more talk of boat. If you want the boat, new channel, this is fishing only. But oh, I'm really sorry, guys. So that is it now. Right. If you want to follow the boat still, if you still want to follow it, yeah. Birchwood 22 Restorations with Dave. Link is in the description. Uh, the next video on this channel, I guarantee to you now, I know I've lied to you a couple of times, the next video on this channel is fishing. Definitely, definitely. Hopefully, like I say, an early morning fish, getting a few money out. That would be absolutely awesome if we can get down there and do that. So, right, guys, again, a massive apology for all the mix-up with the other channel. Jump on the new one, watch the new video. We're starting to make way with the boat. All good. Right, guys, absolutely awesome. I hope everyone's had an awesome weekend. I know a lot of you got, I've got, I'm off now, I'm off Monday and Tuesday, I'm not back into Wednesday, I know a lot of you are probably back to work tomorrow morning, so yeah, condolences for going back to work tomorrow morning. Right guys, absolutely awesome, and I will catch you on this channel, doing what I do best, fishing. <laughs> right, I'll see you later guys.